For the first time, we are hearing from the man seen on video in a controversial arrest by L.A. County Sheriff's deputies. Marla Tay is here with details on that. Christine, that man now has a well-known civil rights attorney representing him. In fact, he has a whole legal team after he was arrested Sunday morning in Inglewood. Cell phone video shows the dramatic and violent takedown of 24 year old Blake Anderson Sunday morning outside a hookah lounge in Inglewood. You can see an LA County Sheriff's deputy punch Anderson in the head and slam his head into the pavement as witnesses shout at deputies. The incident leaving Anderson with several bodily injuries, including potentially permanent damage to his right eye, according to his lawyers, who held a press conference in South L.A. today. Out the helm, well-known civil rights attorney Benjamin Crump. Not just excessive force, but brutality. Anderson, wearing protective glasses and an eye patch, says doctors expect him to lose his sight. A GoFundMe page set up for Anderson and his family notes he had a pre-existing eye injury at the time of Sunday's arrest. Honestly, I just was doing my job for my family. Anderson says he was working for a security company as a security guard when deputies approached without cause or explanation. Alleging that we somehow blinded someone who was working as a security guard, none of the above is true. Sheriff Alex Villanueva says Anderson has a criminal background and is now facing several felony charges, including felon in possession of a firearm and assault on a peace officer with a firearm. He is a convicted felon. He was armed. And there was a struggle, and uh, there's a use of force that's being properly investigated. This is the gun the sheriff's department says was found on Anderson. Anderson's lawyers say they're filing a claim against the sheriff's department and a federal civil rights lawsuit. The sheriff has to speak to this. Because it does take a village to litigate these cases, because ultimately we will get justice. Attorney Crump says he is sending letters to both the California Attorney General and the Department of Justice asking for the use of force incident to be investigated. But so far, the AG doesn't have this case, right? It's still a no, sheriff it's, thing? No, it's still just the uh, sheriff, LA County Sheriff's uh, Department, that is investigating.